Hi, hey, this is Positive Love Hills. Gail Jones coming to you from Tampa, Florida. And um, I'm doing a quick video because, uh, you know, God is definitely using the foolish things to confirm the wise. Um, not only that, God is just, um, most high God is, uh uh is revealing um spirits of truth to me and i'm realizing that god is actually preparing me um yesterday and i'm gonna stop saying um <clears throat> so much yesterday during my lunch time i really had no appetite so i decided i'd just get in my car and just kind of ride roll down the windows get some fresh air when most high god reminded me said go to the store and go get that perfume that you wanted to buy so last week I was in a store and I only used two kinds of perfumes and I was about out um, of um, actually out um, of both of them. Um, and uh, I said, you know what, you know, I says, I don't have time to be um, spending money on that. You know, um, guy has, I'm a giver. I used to just give, give, give to, to where I gave myself away in so many words. And God has taught me, has disciplined me on that over the years. I mean, even to um, when it was time for me to get another car. Um, those of you who know me, listen, I was like, the car was like done, okay? I was still trying to figure out how to keep the car moving. moving. I put brand new tires on the car and still was trying to figure it out. And uh, uh, then when I woke up the next morning, I was at my brother's house up house out in the country i woke up the next morning i mean my mind was set on keeping that car honey it was it was a hump de dump de boop de i was i was set on keeping that car i didn't want to get any you know i didn't want to get another car and i woke up that morning i had a flat tire on brand new tires I had a flat tire and i was just like okay god you know okay god i give up you know you want to you you know you're showing me that i am worthy that i need to um to 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 sow into myself okay god so you know i made the move and um what a blessing what a miraculous blessing it was so anyways god says you know what go and i says i don't have time to be spending money on that i got other things to do and he reminded me he says but i just blessed you i just gave you an unexpected blessing to where it would you, you know you don't I gave you an unexpected blessing and I am instructing you to go and do that for yourself. So I went and I did it. So I was like, all right, cool. Hey, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know, and yesterday I posted on one of my pages, a story that says, um, this woman is blessed. And so I posted a page because I was really just reflecting on, um, what God had just um, reminded me of earlier that day. I was going to post the actual picture of, me being, of uh, being in the store. I said, no, nah, I'm not going to do that, you know. Um, and I felt like I was supposed to. I was like, no, nah, I'm not going to do it. I was just going to post this woman is blessed. Well, I, you know, as I shared with you before, God has me going in my scriptures more, going in the scriptures more, teaching me things um, and um, showing me things. And um, long story short, um, I woke up for this morning and someone that I know, um, don't see them often as well, um, posted um, something very negative, uh, 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 made a negative comment. And I thought, oh, wait a minute, who they think they are? You don't come up on my page posting like that, you know? And I expect people that I don't know, people that don't really know me, you know, in my intimate space, as far as the the good heart, the kind, the good person that I am, or um, I I you know I kind of expect a person to misunderstand and you know in and have their own percep perception of who I am, but I did not expect someone who God has used me to bless before in 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 um, be present um, during one of their childbirths um, um, to speak to their child at that time to say hey it's okay you can come forth I didn't expect that to come from that individual so I got mad. You know, I was just like, you know what? I'm going to block, you know, the devil is a liar, you know, Deuteronomy 28, you know, which one of the scriptures that I was reading last night. So, um, I eventually, I end up going to sleep and I text, um, you know, I text a couple of people and, um, this morning when I woke up, um, a friend of mine's, uh, responded, says, don't delete her. Cause I was just like, she deleted says don't delete her you know um she needs to see what god is doing in your life um and it was just some more things that he said and it it i had to step back and i says oh my god lord forgive me 
um, for my lack of knowledge, my lack of understanding, and my ignorance because I was just sharing with that individual. And I think I was also just sharing on one of my previous posts how I know with the foundation of education and where God has taken me that um that it's on the mental health part, but also God has God is teaching me spiritually. Um, some of the things that um, that he's going to use and he's going to work through me, you know, in uh, in coaching and uh, also, you know, with, with my degree. But in my mind, I'm like, you know what, that's going to happen once I finish school because I'm trying to figure out, well, how, God, how are you going to implement the spiritual part? You know, um, I just do the videos to come on and inspire people, you know, just to kind of talk a little bit while I'm on my journey. Honey, I had no idea. God just, you know, God used that, you know, used that individual to say, don't block her. She needs to see what God is doing in your life, you know, and um, just some more things. And I am telling you, I had to humble myself um, to, uh, you know, to the word of the Lord, um, to the words that were spoken, because I know that was God speaking to that individual. And, you know, I had done a blocker. As soon as I unblocked her, even if she's listening, as soon as I unblocked her, I said, you know what? I'm I'm still going to love you. I'm going to pray for you even more intensely now. Um, and she responded and she stated that in so many words, like she's been calling on God, but she gets, she don't hear him. It's almost like, you know, you know, and she's been, you know, trying to call on, you know, uh, uh, the negative forces and, and it's like no one's responded to her. And that's when God showed me the reason why he had me going through my scriptures last night. And I thought I was just tripping, you know, which I knew I wasn't, you know, but I'm like, man, you know, I'm not trying to be all, you know, you know, this person right here, you know, I just want to be cool, you know, inspire people, love on people, love yourself, the positive, positive hills, you know, be the social worker, you know, and move on, you know, that's my thought, you know, but God used me most high God and, um, the scriptures that God was showing me last night. It was two of those scriptures in which I was able to send to her. So anyways, um, I'm just very thankful for, I'm getting a little choky, okay? Get a little teary eye. I'm very thankful for what God is doing for me in my life. And um, in my life through me. And, um, you know, and I'm so appreciative um, for this journey um, that he has placed me on. I mean, even some more things that I was talking about as um, um, far as uh, when the adversary come against you, you know, and, and, and when people are using, they may knowingly and unknowingly um, being used um, to attack you, to come against you. And, um, you know, God just used another thing. And he told me that, that he would use the foolish thing to confirm the wise. And, um, uh, 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 I mean, that just happened moments ago. And I said, you know, oh my God, thank you, Lord, so much because you are so moving in my life. You are so present. I know you. he's always have been present. And if you look back on some of my videos here, even on my YouTube page, and if you know me, I know God has always been present, but I know that um, um, I'm seeing that this thing is bigger than me, which I always knew was bigger than me, but I'm seeing it's bigger than me. And when I say that, that God's purpose is never on hold. We may think we have to get uh, earned or, 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 or get a certain degree or, or be financially established before, you know, you know, before God sends your mate or, 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 you know, or have a certain terminology that you use there to speak proper, you know, before God allows you to start talking, and encouraging people. That was one of my problems, speech impediment, you know. I'll mess up some words in a minute, as you've heard me say before. God don't just wait for you to get to a point that you're comfortable with before he began to use you even more and take you to that next level. So continue to trust the process and know that all is well. Um, continue to love yourself the positive, positive love heals. And I just want to come on and just let you know again that um, that I love you, God loves you, um, most high God loves you. And honey, remember that God purpose is not on hold. Trust the process all is well know that you are awesome you're amazing you are worthy you are wonderful you are beautiful and he loves you and i love you too this is gail jones positive love hills in temple florida i gotta go but i had to come on and just share that with you today um deuteronomy 28 john 14 14 you always you know i love jeremiah 29 11 um there are just some more scriptures that god was just kind of 
take me through last night but those just a few to get you started let you read up on some things and know that um that god loves you more than anything he loves you and his love is unconditional and i am so thankful for what he's doing in my life positive love heals gail jones in florida i'm out peace Mwah. bless you have a great day